Shalom friends. Today I'm going to share with you on the Jezebel spirit. Yes, the Jezebel spirit. Jezebel is spelled as J-E-Z-E-B-E-L. Church, are you aware of this Jezebel spirit? I'm sure many of you have heard of this spirit. And the Holy Spirit has revealed to me more about this spirit. This demonic spirit is always seeking to destroy God's church and his ministers. Do you know that this evil spirit assisted even during Moses' days? And you can find this out in Numbers chapter 16. Now, how does this Jezebel spirit operate? Number one, those Christians controlled by this spirit initially started off as humble and enthusiastic servants of God. When their newfound popularity spreads, and if they don't check their lives, you know what will happen? Pride, self-confidence, and strife will come in, and they unconsciously open the door to this Jezebel spirit. Number two, this Christian will appear spiritual on the outside, may even prophesy, and can pray eloquently. They hate true prophets of God and those moving in the prophetic and will try to win them over at first. And when that doesn't work, they will distance themselves and criticize and condemn these other Christians. Number three, they are very manipulative and dominating. As 1 Kings chapter 21 tells us, putting on false humility before men and seeking sympathies and self-pity. Number four, they love being idolized here and there, especially from those unsuspecting Christians, glorifying in their newfound fame. And number five, they hardly will admit their mistakes and will try to guilt you instead. And if they repent, it is false repentance to stay on your good side. Number six, the Jezebel spirit loves to have preeminence over Christians instead of letting Jesus have preeminence over all things. As stated by the Apostle Paul in Colossians chapter 1, verse 18. In 3 John chapter 1, verse 9 and verse 10, the Apostle Paul said that Jerotrephes refused to heed his advice, but instead gossiped maliciously and took preeminence over the church. And lastly, number seven, last but not least, this demonic Jezebel spirit looks for those who are hurt, lost, wounded, insecure, and emotionally unstable to manipulate and dominate them and gain prominence as spiritual parents. You can easily discern as it is a self-centered and not Christ-centered ministry controlled by a demonic spirit, which is an abomination to the Lord. We need to be watchful and to pray against this demonic Jezebel spirit. It may come in one way, but it shall flee in seven ways, as God promised. Hallelujah. Deuteronomy chapter 28 verse 7. God says, The Lord will cause your enemy who rise against you to be defeated before your face. They shall come out against you in one way, but shall flee before you in seven ways. Amen. Fellow Christians, you need to be aware of such a Jezebel spirit and do not let it destroy God's church and your ministries. Christians, be aware of such 
a Jezebel spirit. Do not let it destroy God's church and God's ministries. You can easily discern the man or woman with the Jezebel spirit. They will always abuse their positions and authority in the church. Instead of seeking to be a servant of all and to serve with true humility, just as Christ did as a leader. As Mark chapter 9 verse 35 tells us, the man or woman with the Jezebel spirit loves to be always in charge and is self-seeking and dominating and will never take no for an answer. Continue to discern and pray against this demonic spirit and may your church and ministries continue to be blessed by our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Remember to subscribe and to click the bell button to be notified of my latest videos. God bless. Hi, welcome to my channel. This channel consists of three categories of videos on worship songs. Thank you Jesus for your love to me. Engkau ada bersamaku di setiap musim hidupku. On sermons and they are short and inspiring messages. How many of you need a miracle and healing from Jesus today? And lastly, on miracle healing. Do like and subscribe to my channel link so that you will be able to receive notification from YouTube on my latest videos and update. Jesus bless you.